Well, I don't know about you Ooh. ladies, but I did get outside today. <laughs> Even though I could use 10 more degrees, it was still a beautiful sunny day. And Aww. I'll try to be as positive as I can. This video here from along the canal shot today. Yeah. Oh, look, she's getting her walk in. Yeah, yeah, you see, even with that, you need a little bit of a jacket today. Pansy's looking really pretty out there. Ran yeah. across a deer on our walk this oh. morning. I was layered up a little more winter-like yeah. when I walked earlier. But this afternoon, it's really warmed up nicely with that sunshine. Yeah, we're close to 60 degrees, but I had my winter coat on. You said you mm -hmm. had two sweatshirts on. I had two on. sweaters. I, I forgot my hat, though. you got to protect oh. from the sun, you guys. <laughs> my forehead is like a little tender. <laughs> and it was sunny. Uh, lots of sunshine today. We're going to take you back outside. You know what sunshine means this time of year? What? Construction. Um, oh, look, at this. look at that this is, backup. Woo, 465 in Man Road. So we're on the southwest side of Marion County. But I picked this one um, for a couple of reasons. Can you spot them? Okay. There's a, a Purdue logo on the right. Okay. And a Trine logo on the left. Oh. And if you know me, that's where my uh, you're right my in the middle, baby. Yes, and you are right in the middle. I, yeah, I'm not seeing them, but I trust that they're there. They're and there. Uh, we're, we're we're go boilers and go <laughs> thunder. The thunder. Excellent. Yes. <laughs> um, no thunder in our forecast at least the next uh, 24 hours, but we do have rain moving back in. Uh, that was a view on the southwest side of Marion County. Now we go downtown Indianapolis, where we have lots of sunshine at this hour. We're also close to 60 degrees, currently 59. The winds are light at this hour. 59, also the high temperature for the day, but here's the 10 degrees that Felicia needs. We should be in the upper 60s. Our average high is 68. We drop back into the 30s this morning. Sunset this evening is at 834, and we will have more patchy frost, especially across the northern part of the state first thing tomorrow morning. Out the door temperatures 35 to 40. From there, it's a fast warm-up. We'll be in the upper 50s by midday, and about five degrees warmer tomorrow compared to what we have today but this time tomorrow we will also be tracking some rain a developing storm system down to our southwest responsible for tornado watches across the central sections of Texas pointing this out because this is the weather system that's going to track our way over the next 12 to 24 hours clear tonight no problems on the roadways aside from evening traffic and that construction roads are dry but you can see that developing storm system start to inch our way by first thing tomorrow morning it's still southwest of Evansville so our morning drive on Thursday will be dry, confirming that with future track 13. This is midday tomorrow, so if you need some dry time on Thursday, you're at least going to have the early half of the day, probably through early afternoon before we start to see that rain move in from south to north between about 1 p.m. and 4 p.m. This is 4 o'clock tomorrow afternoon. Tomorrow evening at this point looking pretty damp. We'll be dealing with some rain, maybe a few rumbles of thunder over the next, well, as we get into tomorrow night and the early part of Friday. This is Friday at 7 a.m. We do still have some lingering rain around, but then that spins up to the north. Not a lot of sunshine Friday, but we'll have some peaks of it as the clouds start to break, and it won't be a washout start to finish. Can't rule out some additional spotty showers developing in the afternoon on Friday, but we also get lots of dry time. Temperatures will be in the middle and upper 60s over the next several days. Take full advantage. It is not going to be a Felicia day on Sunday. Damp, breezy, and cool but we do get close to 70 on Saturday. Uh, rain late tomorrow, a few showers early Friday, a pop-up Saturday, but lots of dry time over the next three days too.